Hello everyone. Welcome back to E classes of Statistics Standard 11th. In this video we are going to start exercise 3.3 that is related to geometric mean. We already have studied the meaning and formula of geometric mean. Let's read the meaning. If n observations of given data are positive and non-zero, let it be x1, x2, x3 up to xn. Then the nth root of the product of n observation is called the geometric mean of the data and it is denoted by g. The formula for geometric mean is nth root x1 multiply x2 x3 up to xn. Let's solve the sum from exercise 3.3. Let's begin with sum number 1 of exercise 3.3. Let's read the question. The following data show the number of books read by 8 students of a class during the last month. 21591324. So here there are 8 observations and we have to find the average number of books using geometric mean. So let the observation be x1 is equals to 2, x2 is equals to 1, x3 is equals to 5, x4 is equals to 9 and so on. So these are the observations and we have considered them x1, x2, x3 and up to x8. Now using the formula of geometric mean that is nth root of the observation. So here there are 8 observations. So 8th root of x1, x2, x3, x4 up to x8. Now we are going to put the values as it is given in the question. So x1 is 2. 1 into 5 into 9 into 1 into 3 into 2 into 4. So this will give you, multiplying all these 8 observations will give you 2160. So whenever you have to find the 8th root, here you have to find the 8th root of 2160. Whenever you have to find the 8th root, square root process is done thrice. Here you can see 3 square roots are shown. Because you have to do square root thrice, of the number 2160. So once if you do the square root of 2160, you will get 46.4758. After that, you have to do the square root of 46.4758, you will get 6.8173. Again, you have to do the square root of 6.8173. So you will get the answer 2.61 books. So the mean books read is 2.6761 books. So here, whenever the 8th root is given, you have to do thrice the square root process. So here we are done with sum number 1. Let's begin with sum number 2 now. Sum number 2. Let's read it. The value of a machine depreciates at the rate of 10%, 7%, 5% and 2% in its first 4 years respectively. Find the average rate of depreciation using an appropriate method. Here it is shown that the value of a machine depreciates at the rate of 10%, 7%, 5% and 2%. As the total percent is 100, so how we will, how we are going to find the observations? 10% depreciation means 100 minus 10 that is 90 same way 100 minus 7 that is 93 this way we are going to find the first four observations here there are four observations so we are going to find the fourth root of all the observations let's solve the sum and be more clear here you can see we have subtracted all the depreciation values from 100 as they are given in percentage. So 100 minus 10, 90. 100 minus 7, 93. 100 minus 5, 95. 100 minus 2, 98. So this way we will get all four observations. As there are four, four observations, so we are going to find G is equals to fourth root of all four observations. And all four observations are 90 into 93 into 95 into 98. So multiplying all these four observations, we are getting 7 crores 79 lakhs 24,700. So we have, we have to find the fourth root of 7 crores 79 lakhs 24,700. As we have to find the fourth root, we have to do the square root process twice. 
So doing the square root of 7 crores 79 lakhs 24,700 we are getting 8,827.4968 and doing the square root of 8,827.4968 we are getting 93.95. Now as the rate of depreciation was given in percentage so we are going to deduct 93.95 from 100. So 100 minus 93.95 is equals to 6.05%. So the average of depreciation is 6.05%. Now let's solve sum number 3. Let's read sum number 3. A taxi travelled 15 km on Monday and 254 km on Tuesday. Find the average distance travelled over these two days using geometric mean. So here there are two days that means there are two observations 15 km and 254 km. So geometric mean is equals to square root of x1 into x2. So whenever you have to find just a square root that means you have to find only once square root as you have to find geometric mean of two observations so you have to do the square root process only once so first we are going to multiply the observations 15 into 254 that is 3810 now we have to do the square root of 3810 that is giving 61.725 and making it in round figure 61.73 kilometer so the average distance traveled by a taxi is 61.73 kilometer so in the topic of geometric mean we learned that if we have to find eighth root we have to do square root process thrice if we have to find fourth root we have to do square root process twice and if we have to find the square root that means only once we have to do the square root go through the exercise 3.3 revise it thoroughly thank you